Hello, everybody! Welcome back to another fantastic, wonderful, booting my own horn episode of <laughs> Joey T Games here. We are playing Resident Evil. We're in the art room. We're taking a look at uh, some of the art, and it's nice, and I like it. And those are some scary masks. So we're gonna head out the door. We just got the red jewel. What else did we get? The key card for the shot, shot, shotty shotgun. Hope you enjoyed last episode. I thought that was a lot of fun. We are learning the. Oh, I'll come back for you. We're, we're this isn't the last time we're passing through, okay? Um, so we are going to go get the shoddy, but we're not going to do that until we drop off some stuff into our storage box. The storage box has been a staple of Resident Evil since the beginning. It's a really nice way to. Um, Basically teleport your items to different parts of the uh, the uh, wherever you are. <laughs> so let's see. We got the. Uh, we're not gonna need this for a while. So do that. At it. Yeah, we got some hair. Honestly, we might want to store that, which is kind of weird. I know, but we already got a full sixty. Um, this looks. Pretty dang good. Pick a spot for our shotgun. I like to have my weapons. Like, don't call me weird. Uh, shotgun. I gotta remind myself what the shotgun is. No, this is the right way. Yep. Go through the waiting room. Anything scary gonna happen? Oh God! Please don't let it be a liquor. Liquor. I just met her. Oh God. So a liquor is a scary enemy that. Has not been introduced to us yet. Uh, oh, but it will be. And it's not fun to deal with. Uh, do I go all the way down here? Let's try it. Definitely not fun to deal with. They are four legged freaks with uh, brains for faces. And they, they're scary. Oh, jeez! <laughs> that. Uh you, I hope you can tell what I'm actually... Ugh, the, the lady voices for the zombies are so scary. I hope you can all tell what I'm actually scared because I, I'm feeling a Jeez. I'm feeling a chill. Chills go down my spine, literally, and my legs, so that was fun. Uh, that's not right. That's not... Ah! Okay, you can tell when I'm acting. I'm never acting, honestly. I'm having a good time, and you can tell when I'm actually freaking scared. Like, this is some scary shit. So, I take comfort... What the? Oh yeah, you, take that tally down. Put it in the compilation video. Speaking of compilation videos, please. Please take the time to like and subscribe, please, if you're new to the channel and having fun here. Uh, and that, I promise I'll only say it once. I think it's annoying, too, when I'm watching other videos. Uh, wanna, I wanna test it to see if that actually helps my channel grow. I wanna test it! All right, so let's go in here. We don't have the three button for that yet, but we're gonna go down the hallway. Use the key card, immediately discard it, or it probably just stays in there. Yep. And we get, no, oh, they're so, they're so nice. They give us some shells and shotguns. So they give us the shells so that we can rally around your family with a pocket full of them. Here we go. Shotgun time, shotgun is, ooh, they knife. Shotgun is very important because it's awesome. Not only that, but uh, like I mentioned in the first episode, you are going to uh, have a very fun time with a shotgun for getting rid of enemies uh, like the regular zombies. Um, because you can just blast their heads open. You don't have to worry about them coming back again. Pretty awesome. All right, so I want to go through here. There's actually some cool stuff in this room that I'll show you guys. Yeah, gunpowder we already know about. Very important. This guy's gonna get up. Or is he? Is he really gonna try and trick me? This guy gets up for a fact. And I think it's when I explore uh, different parts of the room that, that triggers that. Uh, I hope you've all been impressed with my uh, memory for this game. Please let me discard it. 
Yeah. Okay, so this is very important. Not a lot of people know this or pay attention to it, even though it says it right in your face. But that's okay. I'm here to help you. Um, if there's a check mark, a red check mark next to an item, get rid of it. I'm serious about this. Just get rid of it. You will thank me later. You don't want to... Yeah, it's fine to put it in your storage box, I guess, but it's like... If... You don't want to be, like, thinking about it later and be like, Oh, do I need that? Ah, uh, uh, no, there's a red check mark. Um, so, basically, this is gonna say... If you want to read this, you can and pause the video. But... They gave... Leon this first assignment... Of unlocking his desks. Welcome, Leon! And the codes are as follows. The first one is Ned. Ned's Declassified Zombie Survival Guy. That's the first one. The second one is Mr. G! Mr. G! Oh, I remember that, Mr. G! And this is another awesome attachment for our Matilda. So immediately combine that and you got yourself a bigger magazine. <laughs> Let's uh, let's demonstrate our shoddy here. This guy, fire out of me, getting up. Hey ya, dead. Look at that man. Look at that man. Dead. He was already dead, but now he's dead to dead to deader. So yeah, that's we already got that safe. I mean, probably is. Yeah, here we go. More ammo. Excellent. See you there. <laughs> You're late for work, sir. That was fun. Oh, there's a waiting room. I actually never noticed this. That's nice. Not a detail that's going to really... Maybe it'll help you. Just, like, get a layout of the land, but... Um... Alright, so Marvin's still okay. What we need to do is... I don't know. What we have to do? Maybe drop some stuff off in our uh, storage thing? Leon's hurting. Always hurting. Drop off this. And I know it's it's nice to have combat knives, but it's also nice to keep them as much uh, room in our um, pockets as possible. All right, so let's see if my memory gets jogged. We're going to do something... Yeah, okay, I just remembered. Ha ha! We're gonna save. Because that's always nice to do. In the, uh... Hardcore, I think, yeah, hardcore mode. Uh, you save like you did in the original game. Which is only with ink ribbons, so no auto-saving. And, yeah, you gotta use a typewriter. But in this game, there is auto-saving. Nice, of course, but, you know, the older games were... <laughs> Pretty hardcore in that respect. I can afford to take. Uh, can't go over here because, as you'll see in a second, we need a crank. So we can spin that. My memory. God, oh, applauding. Applaud. What is that? Oh, baboom! You okay over there? Ryan. <laughs> so there's a helicopter. Another uh, herb. <gasps> what do we got here? Hey! Hey! Leon! Oh. Claire! Hold on! I'll be Claire. right there! Okay! There she is, featured in her alternate uh, costume. For some reason, I love this interaction. Claire. It's kind of funny. It's so nice to see you. Oh. How are you doing? <laughs> helicopter just came out of yeah. nowhere. Love this shit. Piece. I'm guessing you don't have a key in one of those fancy pockets? Uh, unfortunately. Line delivery. I don't no. know. It's mm -hmm. great. But how are you doing? You know, just surviving. <laughs> That's good. Yeah. Any luck with your brother? No, not yet. Claire, don't lose hope. I'm sure we're gonna find him. And then God said, lose hope. <laughs> you know what that means? Yeah. Dinner time. Dinner time! 
Claire, I think you should go. Don't worry about me, Leon. You take care of yourself. Oh, I'm gonna worry. Claire, you I'm gonna need worry to go my ass off. now. Okay, let's get through this, both of us. Fucking deal, man. Fucking deal. All right, now we get the cutting tool. Very important uh, for other parts of the situation here. Uh, mansion. <laughs> I mean, uh, the police department. That's what I meant to say. Look at all this ammo. Oh my god. Is a cutting tool very important? I think we're actually going to pretty soon get to discard it. Because I know the other one, there's a chain here, and there's going to be a chain right here. And then the other chain is in that hallway off to the waiting room. You see? Oh. So good. So good. Oh, there's an herb here, but I can't. Really... There's actually a lot of items in this room. It's just a flash grenade there. We only have flash grenades. There's a... Oh, we need that, though. There's a thing that makes shotgun shells. I think I'm going to have to combine this just so I have room. You see how inventory management can be sucky? But we'll come back to this room... That's sucky. You know, it's part of the, the tension. All right, now. Oh, no. Definitely need space. Oh, I got an idea. Putting my combat knife in this van. I have extra space because I need the electrical part. Right, now I'm just going to get bit. I have two. Two men for every Leon. Well, now I have even more inventory space because I have to use my... Uh, First aid spray. Funny stuff. Gonna use my shotgun cause I'm back into a corner. Oh no! Oh, two men for every Leon! I'm in caution! Oh no! A catastrophe, it's a disaster! I have to get What the fuck, you dick? Okay. Okay. Give me a sec. I'm dead. I'm dead. All right, Leon, get up. Get up. Get up. That was upsetting. He was in agony. I felt it. All right, Marvin. Marvin, do you copy? Marvin. Oh, I shouldn't have grabbed that. I need... No, I should have grabbed. I need... All right, well, see, this is why autosave comes in handy, because we would have had to start earlier games where I save. <laughs> like the nerve, right? So, let's see. Views. Now I'm not going to be a fucking maroon about not using the shotgun against these guys. However, I do need space in my inventory. This is kind of annoying. Dead! Ass. You hot ass! This is gunpowder? Oh, just come through already. Jeez. It's getting old. What I can do is I still am going to combine this, but I'm going to use it to get the electrical part that I need to open myself up to getting into the next area. Then I'm going to go back. Now that I have more space to get the wheel or the spinny guy for the locker room. Yes? And then once all said and done, I can just come right back here for... Uh, You pissed me off earlier, so we're good. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna come back here. You are fucking dead! <laughs> you know? And you are fucking... My ammo. I'm gonna use my different ammo on you, bitch. Matilda! Matilda! Mat... Mat... You're dead. Wow. Luck be a lady tonight. Hell yeah, dude. But yeah, let me get this herb now. Victory herb. Victory herb! We're coming back here. There's some good shit here. I'm at knife I can't have. So we're gonna drop some shit off. This is where Marvin helped us in the first place. Yep, 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 yep. We're gonna save, because that was uh, sucky. Drop some shit off. Starting to get the flow. I can tell. You guys are good. Oh, we have even more here. Uh, herb drop off there, blah blah blah. So 
Boguma. Go get that stuff that we left behind. Ashi, my kitty, uh, has to have pet. Come on, cuddle. Come on. <laughs> Here. I think I leave the combat knife. Get this for more shotgun ammo. So if you combine that, the yellow, with the regular gunpowder, you get shotgun ammo. Yeah. Right, sweetie? You might have heard me out. She's very sweet. Then you combine this with this. Inventory management for the win. For the win. I don't want the flash grenade right now. Oh, uh, I have the room. <laughs> Got the room for it. This is the thing. But th this room in particular is pretty tough. Because you're probably going to be stacked. While it's all the room in your cargo beams are going to be stacked. So... All right, now we've got the cutting tool. So we're going to go, like I said, through the, the waiting room. Yep, and here it is. And not only that, we also have this. Ooh, I think that's towards this. We're going to have a liquor in here now? That's just in Claire's. That in Claire's. Yeah, I think that's just... Which I will love to play... Oh, no. Death approaches! I said, oh, bro, professional, Leon the professional right there. That was on purpose. All right, so is this. This is on purpose, too. Getting the hell out of your face. Going over here. Then I'm going to use the cutting tool. I get to discard it right after this because there's only three, I think. Yeah, bitch. So, cutting tool. What is this? That's important. Um, going to tell us cap right there. That's a flash grenade, which I can combine with this. That's the chief's office, which can only be accessed by the heart key that uh, Claire gets. And I think I have just enough space for this herb, yeah. Okay, so we go over here. This See? That's fun. Life is full of surprises. Marvin is not doing okay. Oof. Still alive. alive, but he's barely breathing. Do dead, do dead. Praying to a god that he probably believes in. Do dead, do dead. I got time while he got infected. When the heart breaks, no, it don't break. What was I gonna grab? We have gunpowder to create shotties. Nope. Uh. We, the flash grenades can be used as a defensive item, so I'm going to store the knife for now. We have plenty of handgun ammo. Two should be enough, I'm hoping. All right, I came around this way because we have to go to the spot that has the stair. Where are the stairs? I forgot. Let's just explore. But over here. Is it over here? I think so, actually. That's lucky. On this hall. What? What is that sound? That sounded really weird. Oh, she. <laughs> I'm a cop killer! <laughs> now she ain't gonna bother you. Now she ain't gonna bother you. That's the nice thing. I go through here. Oh no, this guy's really scary. No, he's not. Dead. Will not bother you ever. This. Gunpowder? All right, here you go down this hallway. You're going to be introduced to our friend, the liquor. They're even giving you shotgun shells to commemorate the occasion. We're going to take it head on here, folks. Now, here's something to keep in mind for the liquor. They are blind as bats. There's even some documents. There it is up there. <laughs> Let me zoom in. Oh, geez. Ugh. There's some documents that will tell you about how blind it is. 
Um, once you engage it, it's kind of hard to uh, go stealthy once again, but you know, just keep that in mind. All right, this will be the last thing we do in this episode, so let's fucking go! That's scary as hell, he's eating another man! But if I shoot you, I don't want to shoot you yet because I don't know if damage is going to go through. I think this is a cutscene. Oh, a cutscene. And now I shoot you. Yeah. Oh, you missed. You douche. You fell down. And now you're at my mercy. I don't think I've ever done that well against a liquor before. Wow. That man got fucking bopped. Wow, so we're going to go into the star's office on the next episode of Joy T Games. Um, and we're going to be playing more Resident Evil 2 next time we uh, see each other. Bye-bye, well, everybody. Woo!